friends wish you a very happy independence day you are watching chupa khel with pravesh well to begin with i would like to share one very common and famous saying a proverb health is wealth everybody knows that and everybody is happy to have a healthy health but what if health is an issue health is a worry and if that becomes an opportunity to make wealth for you this exactly happen probably may be happening all across the country many many hospitals have converted this pandemic into an opportunity for minting money there are several reports which says that for an ordinary pp kit which hardly cost between 300 to 1500 rupees a hospital many hospitals are charging somewhere around 4 to 5000 rupees per pp kit well that's a big amount i don't know what they are doing are they minting money or doing social service well that's a question always and will remain always here to begin with i'll start with the thing that how a pandemic became opportunity for such some wiser people before i proceed ahead watch this first dr ajay goel ka chirai medical college mein consultant physician hu aur pichle 4 mahine se covid 19 ke treatment mein madhya pradesh sarkar dwara ek aspatal chala raha hu is 4 mahine ke dauran kareeb 4000 covid 19 positive patients ke treatment ka ek well that was mr ajay goenka the director of chirayu hospital in his statement issued two days back he claimed that he is, he i mean his hospital has treated more than 4000 covid 19 positive patients successfully he was sharing his experience over there do you know that since last i mean before last two days before two days before rather it was 7000 plus covid 19 positive patients found in the capital of madhya pradesh that is bhopal and out of these 4000 plus is being treated by a private hospital that is chirayu it's a commendable job i guess our political leaders might be planning to propose his name for bharat bhushan or something like this big award maybe bharat ratna anyways well it's a commendable job i'm not questioning him but the thing is recently a leading newspaper of the bhopal has published a report stating that from 1st of september there will be no free treatment available to the covid 19 positive patient every patient has to pay from his own pocket well that's worry that's worrying everyone is worrying about that according to the report published the mou memorandum of understanding signed between the state government and the chirayu hospital has a validity till the last of this month that is 30th of august i guess and from 1st of september the mou does not remain valid in that case a patient has to pay from his own pocket or go to the government hospital well uh, i'm not going into that but the report again says that of course through their sources they say that around 1.5 lakh per patient is the amount decided between the state government and the chirayu hospital 1.5 lakh per patient irrespective of how many days he has uh, he was admitted what kind of treatment he has been given whether he was there in icu or not how many doctors have attended there are many questions but if you ask the state government they'll say no it's a confidential document well in public interest this document this memorandum of understanding mou signed between the state government and the chirayu hospital has to be has to come ahead the government has to keep, uh, release this document in a public domain so that every every person can have a look that how and why and on what parameters or probably the rates the government is paying to this hospital if those if that report of the newspaper is to be believed an amount of around approximately 60 crores in last 4 months yes april may june july it's a big amount 
60 crores the government will pay or probably paid or might be paying if this report is true why not this amount is given to the Hamidiyah hospital or the Ames hospital which the central government claims a world class hospital or probably a, with each and every features and facilities available here in Ames Bhopal the union government says that similarly the state government claims that yes, they have the better facility here in Amidia Hospital, which is of course uh, a unit of a medical college, Gandhi Medical College. It's worrying that a government hospital, medical college does not have that facility. Why? Because funds are the issue, I guess. Last time I had spoken about this funds for, to the Corona warriors will, be, will not be granted to them. It is worrying. It is shocking. But I must appreciate the management of the Chirayu Hospital who has turned this pandemic thing into an opportunity for minting money is it true well i don't know the question remains the same let the concerning people reply to this question point number uh, the one more thing i would like to share with you that mou has been signed okay fine how many of you know that how many md that is of course masters masters in doctor like uh, md medicine are there in chirayu hospital because uh, one of my sources said that that according to the ICMR, Indian Council for Medical Research guidelines and directives, only MD doctors can treat a COVID-19 positive patient. How many MD doctors does Chirayu have? I don't know. Well, wherever, as far as my sources are concerned, most of the junior doctors are probably only MBBS have treated these COVID-19 patients. And in fact, recently a video went viral of Chirayu Hospital where COVID-19 positive patients who were kept there in isolation were dancing on the terrace of the hospital. They were enjoying there. Might be asymptomatic. Another question comes ahead is like, were those 4,000 plus positive patients, COVID positive patients, were they mild mildly sufferer mild sufferer i mean mild corona was there or minor corona was there or severe corona again a symptomatic and symptomatic issue it's a big thing i don't know what is the inside but yes the coolie poll i'll definitely speak about it the government should come ahead and disclose those documents mou signed between these private hospitals in the government there must be the rates per patient per facility icu bed per bed general private or whatever I have spoken to few of my journalist friends here in Bhopal, but none of them have, are having those documents with them. In fact, when they tried to uh, get those documents, none of the government officials responded to their queries. It's worrying and shocking, of course, this money is from our pocket. The tax which we, we are paying to the government directly or indirectly, this amount will be paid from that. However, the Chirayu has done a commendable job. Every VIP of the state, including the chief minister, the state president of the ruling party, and many other senior leaders, including ministers, cabinet ministers and other leaders, prefer to go to the Chiru Chirayu hospital for their treatment. However, there are some certain exceptions are also there. One of the ministers uh, thought, I mean, uh, choose, opted for uh, taking isolation in his own farmhouse rather than going to this private hospital. But things are literally worrying. Are they minting money? I had uh, information uh, about Delhi, Bombay and other major cities, hospitals charging too much. But here in Bhopal, something behind the curtain is going on. Let the chief minister or the concerning minister or the chief secretary or the principal secretary of the health come ahead with the copy of MOU. I pray that I might be wrong. I don't want to be true on this. Seriously, pandemic is very serious. But don't make it an opportunity for minting money, please. The question is still open. Raise your voice. Well, that's all for today. You are watching Chupa Khel with Pravesh. Catch you soon later with some other interesting topics. Thank you very much.